Yeah. What's up, y'all? It's Tay. It's Jasmine. And we're back with another video. Yes. Today, we're doing a, a mukbang, mukbang. I'm not sure how to pronounce it. Big Dave but cheese steak. We're eating um, Big Dave cheese steak. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I have um, a Philly cheese steak with um, onions. And then I have Philly cheese steak rolls. Mm -hmm. What do you got, Tay? I have Philly cheese steak rolls. I have three because I, I didn't know <laughs> they're going to be like this. <laughs> but the more the merit. And I have a Philly with banana peppers and onions and three cheeses. I don't remember what the three cheeses was. But okay. I'm good. And we're going to talk about a lot of things while we eat. Yes. This place is located downtown. So if you're in Atlanta, mm -hmm. you can go down there and check them out. Yes, they are open during Corona time. So you can eat good. Yes. And we have a, a drink special today, created by me. It's strong. Yeah, it is. So I messed up our video. So we about to dig in. Yes. Make sure we got to see our grace. God is good. God is great. Thank, thank you, Lord, for what is food. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Amen. So we're going to try first. You try that first. I'm going to try the egg roll first. She be picky, so... Oh, know, yeah, I'm but, very picky because we went to study Biggie, y'all, and I had to act like I liked it. We should have did a video on that because y'all would have been like, uh, no. Study Biggie is good. It's, it's, mm. It smells like cat food. Maybe I just don't like that type of food. Cat food. Yeah. Okay. How was it? Good. It's actually good. Um, Let me try. <clears throat> I tried the piece of it's that. It's spicy. It's spicy. It's spicy. It's good, though. It's good. What do, what um the sauce tastes like? It's, it's like sweet. sweet and sour. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's good, though. Mm-hmm. This is a winner. I think I've been waiting for this. We've been, we've been talking about going here for so long, but the lines always be so long. Exactly. You know you don't want to wait 15 freaking hours for the food. But, it wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad. We waited like 20 minutes. But we waited about 30, 40. And then we had to pay for parking. Mm -hmm. So, if you're not good at driving or parallel parking, you don't need to go down there. Um, you always have some characters. Yeah, because this is in the middle of the hood. Yeah, and it was like junkie city. Coming up at so many, doing dances. Mm -mm -mm. It's good. It is. Look, I'm seeing it. Dave, I want to tell you. I'm mad I didn't get we to see it. We was looking you, for you. Well, I was looking for you. Period. And this really was. Girl, I was looking for you. I'm like, he probably in the kitchen. You wasn't we couldn't even get in the door. Like, you know, due to the corona, we had to order at the front door. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they were waiting for you at the door. Really? So, this is good, though. It really is. I oh, know. But, yeah, I'm tired of this corona mess. Mm. It's single day mayo next week, and I'm trying to go get really? some margaritas and some tacos. But What's I'm not about it. I'm not about to be out there with them people. I'm gonna do our homesick in the mile. What day is it? May 5th. Oh, yeah. What day is May 5th? <laughs> I was about to it's week. It's today the 2nd. It's Tuesday. Mm. I know I wanted to I'm get I'm gonna have to call to work. For that? You gotta mess up a drink? Man, I know, man. Corona messing up a lot of stuff, man. Yeah. People on summer bodies, people vacations. Hmm. I'm supposed to be at the gym, but I'm over here eating Philly cheesesteaks. Big days, to be exact. It's okay, I'm Ooh. a little slender there. Let's see how it tastes. Oh my god. It's a little thick, don't got a lot of meat on there. This is not, this ain't something, this thick thick. <laughs> oh yeah. Is it that's good? That, that's that one. 
That joint was juicy when you been in that joint. Mm-hmm. It's good. It's good. I know it's good. I just want to see if it was good to you, because you know you be picky, girl. Mm-hmm. You know, yeah. I like to eat. So... That's, That's why, good. Cause you said that meat tastes different. It tastes good. If I ever get a man, I hope he know how to feed me. Cause I like to eat. For real. So let's talk about something else. Look at that. Let's talk about. That's that thing right there. Ain't it? That's that one. Baby. What's that one? I'm trying to figure out what banana peppers are. Oh, don't it? Don't it taste like the beet tastes better quality? Yes, it is. Cause it's. It's um what he said is grass, grass fed. It's grass fed, so you know, this that vegan meat. Mm-mm-mm. So what we about to talk about sis? Let's talk about how do you feel about people having opinions on your life? Let me tell you something. You should only give your opinion when I ask you for advice. What? If I don't ask you for advice, honey, don't give me it. And don't be trying to tell me what I need to do with my life when your life ain't straight. Okay? <laughs> I'm preaching. Let me see. Well, them be the most people that be giving advice. I like to give advice too sometimes. But sometimes like you have to that. give advice when it's asked. Yeah. I'm just going to shut up sometimes. Don't say nothing. Because sometimes people are like, I don't know what you're thinking. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, some people really don't care about your opinion. <laughs> just <laughs> <laughs> oh my real. goodness I'm so weak I'm so weak I mean if I come to you and I ask you how you feel about this you know it's different but don't be coming to me man. I don't, you don't need to be doing it you don't need to be doing this yeah. you need to be getting your stuff together why are you chasing after him and mm-hmm. I can't stand with somebody be sometimes, even though they don't, even though they don't ask, sometimes you gotta tell that person if you love yeah. them. Because it depends on if it get that far. I'm telling you, especially I can't stand on somebody be trying to tell you about who you talking to, and your man, but they over there playing boo boo the fool. They man, you feel what I'm saying? Girl, bye. Okay. That's the truth. I don't know what's wrong with these people. They need to mind their business. Mind the business that pays you, sis. Because a lot of people, mm, so a lot of people is, not people your is on here broke because they don't know how to mind their business because it's not paying them anything. I'm not getting paid to my hers. I'm going to say something. I lost some liquor. <laughs> I did not. I did good. Why are you trying to eat cute, sis? I'm not trying to eat cute. Girl, I don't care. I'm trying to savor it because it's so good that I don't want to eat it fast. I want to let the world know what I like to eat. <laughs> this is good. This is good, too. Now, do you have a question? Hey, since you're in a relationship, how do you know that Brandon was the one? Huh? Girl, why are you brushing? Oh God! Oh, he give you butterflies? No. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just stupid. Um, I don't know. You just get a feeling, you know. You be like, dang, this person kind of different, or you be like, especially if you got a role model in your life already, like you got a daddy, so you know how. A man is supposed to treat the woman. Mm-hmm. So when you find somebody like that, it's kind of easy to target and be like, oh, this man acting like my daddy a little bit of traits. Well, yeah. if you got a good daddy. Mm-hmm. If you got a good daddy. If you got daddy at all. Yeah, if you got daddy at all. But some people got daddies and they don't do nothing to even show the way. But I was blessed to have a good daddy that could show me how a man supposed to treat a woman. So... When dealing with him, I was like, oh, he got a lot of qualities, you know, like my dad. And he was different. So, I think you just know when you know. But the basis is friendship first. Mm -hmm. Friendship, friendship, friendship. If you don't have a friendship first, then you're not going to have a long-lasting relationship because you got to be able to be friends with them, know stuff about them before you just go into to a stand. Oh, I love this person. This is everything. We're going to have kids and get married. And No. Mm-hmm. 
Because you don't know them. So why are you saying this? Just take it slow. When you take things slow, the outcome is better. How long do you think that you should wait until you be, like, getting in a relationship with that? I say almost, like, five, six months, you know. That's just me. But somebody else could think something else. But not, like, no month or nothing. I say at least three is the minimum. So within them three months, are y'all just friends? Or no, are y'all, y'all, dating? De- y'all they going on dates and stuff. Mm-hmm. Like y'all dating, y'all not talking to yeah. nobody else, but y'all not like you know on a level of oh my gosh, I love them. Or even if you is, you ain't saying it yet yeah. until that come up. But y'all not doing nothing but going on dates, just enjoying each other's company, mm-hmm. just getting to know each other first. Not on a, cause you know, in our generation, all boys be like, oh, let me uh, come over to your house. Yeah. They don't actually want to take you out on a date. They want to take you out and pay for something. You know, they want to sit up there and say, oh, let me come over. What That's are you coming you know. to my house for? You not about to be my, you not about to be none of my folks. Okay. Cause I don't know you. <laughs> ones that I don't like. like <laughs> That's when you first do. meet a guy and all they want to do is just chill. All right, what would like, you I understand that you don't have to take me on a date. But you can just... No, I'm saying like the first time I meet you, you don't have to take me on a date. I'm just saying we can go out. We don't have to just You chill. go to the park. Yeah, just... Like, you don't even have to go somewhere that pays. No, like, you have to call park. something. You chill to the outside park. of the house because if, if you're yeah. in the house, something gonna happen. What's the point of chilling when I can chill at my house? Mm-hmm. With my show, with you on the phone. You know what spicy is this? That's spicy? Mm-hmm. But yeah, I don't know what's wrong with these guys, these generation, man. Yeah. This generation. All they want to do is chill. They don't want to even take you to Chick-fil-A. And I <laughs> like Chick-fil-A. Like, this is a little expensive. That's the point. <laughs> you better take me to Chick-fil-A rather than McDonald's. But to just summarize that, I think you just know what you know. And even if it don't work out, at least you said you tried at the end of the day. So, within the dating stage, like you said, you waited eight months? To say, um... Yes. We were like, yeah, like six. Did y'all kiss? A little longer, I got a lot. <laughs> I just want to know if y'all kiss, like... Well, I didn't. I thought kissing was nasty because you know I don't like all spit. So I'm I'm so weird. I didn't like none of that stuff. But we were paintballing. We was paintballing, and then this nigga just kissed me out of nowhere. And I said, I ain't want to wipe it off. Cause that's what I used to do. When niggas kiss me. I'll be like, Oh, he just kissed you. He just kissed me. He was like, Come here. Oh, that's I said, so cute. Oh, okay. But yeah, I mean. Yeah, I think you sh- I think you should do that when you are in the dating stage. I don't think it's nothing wrong with that. Just don't do nothing else. Yeah. Don't do that. Because then that's going to break up your friendship. That's going to be like, oh, we're on another level now. So now we're in a way. That's basically kind of forcing you to be in a relationship with somebody. Because yeah. that is on the whole level of like you knowing somebody. You Now you just you really, really know them. You really, really know them. Yeah, so, when you... People just don't know. When that happens, you be exchanging, exchanging energies and stuff. Mm-hmm. Like, this is so tough. Mm-hmm. And people don't understand that. So, and the people that don't have feelings, they just cold hearted. Yeah. Yeah, for real. Yeah, what's that? No, it's like the meat. Oh, I don't like that part. <laughs> just eat it. Dave. Nah, not that good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm cool now. This stuff is juicy. You don't even need nothing for real. You don't even need the sauce. This meat is well seasoned. The whole thing is well put together. I ate one egg roll. How many ate? Uh huh. Girl. I'm cool. Because it's so rich, bro. It's so rich and so good. It's rich. Mm-hmm. There's so much cheese on here. Are you full? I think I'm full and tipsy. You tipsy? A little bit. I didn't drop more than you. I know. I got a little tolerance. You put a lot of liquor in there. A lot <laughs> of taste is liquor in mine. <laughs> Jazz, we got matching glasses. 
No, we don't. It's really clear. But well, mine a different shape of yours. Yeah, mine's a square. I hope y'all staying safe out here with this corona stuff. Yeah, I work with it. We tested at my lab. <laughs> <laughs> Coronavirus! <laughs> I touch it every day. How do but you feel saying, about it? I mean, I feel kind of scared sometimes because it's like... Me opening up that that specimen and it's that coronavirus on this like it's so close. Mm-hmm. It's in my hand, so it's like, damn, can I get this? But I'm extra careful because we wear gloves, we gotta wear masks, we gotta wear our lab coats. It's like, you know, it's just it, and it's only I only feel that way because I touch a lot of stuff like HIV, herpes, a whole committee. Like I'm touching so much stuff. That this is only scary because it's new and it is not no vaccine for it. But like influenza is just as bad as that. Mm-hmm. It's just only because it's a a cure to it. Exactly. My best friend. No, that shit's not good as hell. Hey, we're, we're doing a video. You just uh, got it. Sh- what? This? Mhm. Where that is? Oh, it's just a little extra greasy. Oh yeah, because I put on baby oil. Mm-hmm. Are you just doing bath mm-hmm. Where you been? She, she made some of my video talking to, talking to the ops. Girl, I'm my ops. What's up with the cookies, man? Why you make us none? I did. They definitely gone, kind of, a little bit. Muffins. No, we just making a whole video. Oh, Riri got, not Riri, but, uh. No, Riri, that's my sister. Oh, um, Tay got some uh, air rolls in there. Two. Let me see, Tay. This mouth, you know what? <laughs> Let me Dave, say you got more for everybody. Mom, no, it's mom. Shut up. Dave, you hear this? Oh. Uh, no. No. Bro, don't be fat. <laughs> I am. <laughs> <laughs> she being mad greedy right now. Like, I want to say this for later, though. I'm but number you seven. Got, you got whole number. You got two whole ones. Bro, Jasmine, you got to go now. Because you just told me. I got egg rolls. I got some too. Get one of yours. I only got one left, bro. Right, oh, she me had two. Oh, no, let me get mine. No, oh, she oh, been greedy. I, <laughs> I, I was trying to see how far. Go let my one them taste it too. Go let them taste that one. I oh. taste three. Mm. Yeah, it's good. This is good, bro. Try some sauce. Dang, no. she has to have no, you doing so much. You got some liquor, too. What y'all, what y'all right. get? At this point, why <laughs> y'all got this stuff? We got yeah. exclusive. Was it a long line? Not really, but we was outside. Oh, oh we was outside for a long way at, 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 um... It was like 30 minutes. Yeah, it was long. And we saw a whole bunch of crack kids. This is a raw, uncut mukbang, whatever it is, because it's the real one. This ain't one of them mm. that they do all the videos and you have the like props sauce? in the back. Mm-hmm. We just uh, we, we just original over here. We just do it how we do. And whoever come in the camera, that's just what it is. We can't uh, cut it, edit it. I ain't I think I'm about to eat my arrow. I might as well. You she, might as well. You got two whole ones left. Yeah, and leave me alone with it. Don't tell nobody else. <laughs> Mom. It was good, wasn't it? I don't know. It was worth the money too. It was. It was three fifty a piece, girl. Three fifty. Can I have three fifty a piece for it? Oh, egg roll. One egg roll was three fifty. How many did you get? Three. Oh, so I That's got like one, two, three, three, four, five, six. Mm-hmm. I got six and six halves. That's a lot of money. That's like ten dollars for three egg rolls. It was. It was nah, no tax. Oh, no tax. Nope. It was tax on that. But this is good. So let me know. This was like ten dollars. But it gives me a little piece. I ain't never too. sharing that one. That's what Girl, that's that's, I'll give to the world. Just cut a little piece. Oh yeah, let me put mine up before I eat mine. Yeah, I will eat it on this camera, but I'm gonna save it for my dinner. <laughs> you gonna save it for what? My dinner. <laughs> yeah, we're dinner I don't dinner. know if that liquor hitting or what. It is. It got too much it got too much liquor in there. Really? You not taste that. You already got half a you ain't gonna miss out on that. Jasmine, do you have anything else to say? Because you, you didn't, you, you didn't like really mess up the video. 
Well, Riri don't came in here and start the show. Not really. Y'all ain't even in the camera, y'all. We're precious. Sleep, you know. No. Just put more on. You not gonna let me take some piece of your sandwich? Just... No. No. Sorry. I'm kind of being What you gonna eat that for dinner? Can y'all turn it this way? <laughs> I was gonna eat that. She wants egg rolls. Oh, for dinner? Oh, you gonna eat good. And I'm hot too. You can't let me get a little bean. I don't put this one on she want to be a camera. She want to be on a camera. Don't put this one on They're going to be like, who? Black. Yeah. I don't care. We're just being our authentic selves. Selves, you know? We're grown. We just, we just grown. And we just we just eating. That's all. Eating good on this quarantine. Yeah. You, know, you know how that goes. <laughs> you look like you been drinking. He's this drink is good. This is exclusive to my time. This is exclusive to my time. Jazz, what you doing? You ever touch your boot thing? She got a boot thing, y'all. He Nobody cute. ain't gonna know. Ooh. He handsome. Cute is for girls. Cute and He cute is very be. handsome and he's he very sweet. He is. He is. I was all happy and so far. I was like, oh my gosh, love is so good. But love, I'm not, love is I'm a very dangerous love. thing. That's all I'm gonna say. Oh, you be in love? Um, let's not talk about it. Yeah, we do. <laughs> oh, you got good. Got yes, y'all. I'm happy. Girl, shut up. I'm happy because there was no thing over. Dang, that's sad. No, it ain't. it's happy. It's it's, so it's, it's, it's cool though. You know, that's what life is about. You, you get to know people. Drink, I feel like eating enough juice in here. Juice. Oh. What y'all do, mimosas? Nah, they ain't mimosas, girl. She put like half of the liquor. In a bottle, in a cup. Y'all gonna like this YouTube <laughs> because this YouTube is this gonna be is funny. Scary. This is gonna be so funny. Quarantine queen. Quarantine. My stimulus is coming. It's on the Hold way. Up. Oh, oh yeah, y'all. How y'all feel about this? I'm terrible. Like they they catch the checks. They catch the <laughs> checks on the boulevard. No, mine's going to direct the pass. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah. Man, that okay. took forever, though. Y'all, how you feel about them stimulus, though? Baby? It's on the way. It's on the way. You how know? you feel, Jazz? You got yours? Not in my savings account, girl. Yeah. Ooh, you put it Me in the savings. Too. Yes. Too. Baby, I'm trying to get like, yo, Because <laughs> that bitch is thick. Before, it's not even in my name. <laughs> oh. oh, my gosh. So, I guess it's going to be the end, y'all, because we full. We can't eat no more. We, we can't even eat them all because... I mean, I really could. I wanted to taste this. I'm scared, man. But I think we, we're good now. You're not going to miss out on the small piece. No, I am. let me taste it. I'm mine. not. That was $22. For 20, the sandwich? Yeah, by the time. Yeah, yeah, 22 Was it 22 inches? <laughs> 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 oh, my God. Damn. She showed up. Mm -hmm. Was it, yeah. was it a foot long? Sis, I need some drink by myself. No, you don't. <laughs> I don't got no more ice. Why you don't, you don't like it with that? Uh, you know that's good. You she, got, even... she got too much liquor in there. Girl, she put the liquor right here. She put her liquor up here. Say about Jazz. Jazz. I'm sorry. I'm so focused on her love Somebody else. Her. Yeah. Don't be rolling your eyes, Riri. This Riri. Because you ain't got nobody to make your heart feel warm. I don't give a damn. I don't either. Maybe that's what you need. The Lord got me. I thought it was a long until I had to remember that. I am never alone. Amen. Girl, you should have been that way. That was deep. That was deep, girl. I love the way you said that. You shut up. You might need to be an evangelist. I just, I need to preach to the kids. Somebody in the church? <laughs> you be an usher. Oh, so we can see him. Oh, you gotta be an usher. I don't even know what that is. What's your ushers? Mm -hmm. The people in the church. I haven't been. They be old, though. Some of the ushers be old. Depending mm -hmm. on like, the new church. is slow. Yeah. The only right church that I go to is um my best friend and dad church. Every time like I go home, I go there. That's one church I've been to for a while. I like I like that church. 
It's not too big. It's an intimate type setting. You get the word in. You mm-hmm. go home. It's early. It's good. And you got two good pastors. Shout out to them. Mr. Williams. And I forgot the other name. You know, I need to start going to church. But you know. Oh, you know what? We did go to a church here. Because, you know, I live. I went, I'm from Detroit. Mm-hmm. So, I used to go to church there. But now, I don't know. I've been to Georgia. We went to church one time. We went to a Chinese church. It really wasn't a church. It was. It wasn't a church. It was a hall. It, it was, was like. Storefront. It was. It was. It was the worst experience I ever had with church because, at this point, I was thinking that they were like playing with it what happened because, it, first of all, it was a baptism bed in there, but it was a gray tub like on Ray Charles, where he touched the water and got blind because that's the tub that was in the back of the church for them to get uh, baptized. It was around Thanksgiving, so they was talking about Thanksgiving and stuff, but they Chinese, so they was reading off the projector screen, and the lady was singing, and it was, it was only one lady singing. Everybody in the church was giving stories, and it was like the worst. It was cause something really different. It was something different, because me, Ruri, and... Um, we don't say her name. We don't say her name no more. But we was in there laughing, and I swear, I was, I was like, dang, I'm going to hell, because... I just never experienced nothing like that in my life. Like, I'm so used to, you know, my people church. And I'm not saying that they was teaching something that was different. But it wasn't It wasn't what I was used to. It wasn't a different, like, they believe in the same God as us. But it was like, they just didn't know how to teach the word. It was like they was trying to teach it, but it was yeah, too Chinese. Like, it didn't sound like he had any education. Right. It's like, like he didn't know how to say it. He came and said, like, where's your license or to be or having something. a church? He wouldn't have been qualified. Yeah, yeah, it was like a basement church. It was like, you know, they a, have a lot of them. Y'all, let's yeah. huddle. Like, it was like a meeting, like a team country. meeting. But what really messed me up was the... Oh, name? and and this is crazy. This is how I knew about it is because... I, I got my nails done by him, and he said, have I been baptized? So, he was doing my nails, and then told me to come to church that Sunday, and he was the pastor. And he said, yeah, my church next door to my nail shop. And I should have knew something wrong then. So, it was like, you know, I feel you trying to get people in your church and stuff. Then when they passed around the plate, it wasn't that much to go around, so. Yeah, I don't really do church. I need to. Yeah. But I be feeling like I feel like it's fake sometimes. I feel like it's a big money scam. They just be taking all your money. Yep. And people be in there. They don't be have. Yeah, they don't be have money. Pay their rent, and they be giving their last while at church. While the um pastor and his wife be driving around Bentleys and having mm-hmm. Helico- right. That, yes. That's crap for a dollar for you. But yes. the church I go to, my best friend, um, my best friend dad, he always give back. Like I've been, I was going mm-hmm. to that church forever. Like I wasn't going on a consistent basis, but when I did go, it was like mm-hmm. I was going, and he would take me and stuff. And he was, they was giving out computers to us. Mm-hmm. They was, you know, giving out like gift cards and stuff, or they was having like little stuff for the kids, like or for for us and stuff. Like they was always giving back. Like if you was going off to school, they would give you stuff. It was like the kids was always the main priority. So I just felt like you know that was really good. Um, that was really good. That's like the best church I think I'd have been to was was every church that he preached at. So I really kind of like commend him on that because they they give back instead of trying to take take take. Because Crystal Dollar ain't giving nobody no scholarships. He ain't giving nobody computers. He's just asking for the people to to pass the plate fifty times and asking where's the TV screen. I'm just trying to figure out like I know I'm not really like. Don't know too much about the Bible. Or whatever. But these pastors be like, oh, you got to give in order to receive blessings and all this stuff. Yeah. Like. Give what, though? I don't know. Give money? <laughs> like, they be like, if you don't pay your tithes, then you not going to receive blessings. Yeah. I don't really believe that. Like, and then I don't understand. Like, they be having record offering. They be having, uh, what's the offering for the, um, for the pastors? They do love offering for the pastor. I don't have no like, problem giving them no money because they don't have no jobs. Their job is to, pre- but well, most some, pastors do no, got some, uh, jobs. No, some work. pastors be getting paid. They do. Like if they preach at church, they be getting paid. Yeah. Y'all. I'm just like man, like you know to do uh, at New Birth, they were charging one twenty five for Corona test for to get tested. Oh, nice oh, where you get that from? Fumbler. 
But how are you charging so, 125 to test somebody when they're giving out free tests? I'm just like, it's just a big money scam, man. You want to switch cases? Bro, we on the radio. Not the radio, but we on the video. We on the air. But I just hope that I find a good church home and they change my life. Mm-hmm. Uh, change my life. Yeah, you know, my life. And I honestly don't how I think do about that. the church. Just, just I don't think I want to do that because yeah. um, I feel like because my daddy, we always sat down and just read scriptures out of the Bible and learned like that mm-hmm. because I feel like it's always the people in the church be the most hypocritical and be the mm-hmm. most fraud and like, judge and judgmental and you be like, what is wrong with you because you think you're so holier than thou, but you sit up and sleep with kids. Mm, 16. Yep, 16. I don't know. It's just deep. It, that was deep. I mean, but some people, like, you have to go to church to be, like, believe in God. You don't have to do that. No, you're not going to hell if you're not going to church. It said you've accepted God in your heart so you know you, you believe in the faith. Evangelist yeah. Riri, have you accepted God in your life? Mm-hmm. <laughs> she can call Riri Evangelist. <laughs> I don't even know what the fuck. I mean, I, yeah, I really don't even know what the fuck that is. Yeah, I, that's like, I don't really know what it is either, but I think it's like, you know, like minister and stuff like that. Oh, okay, like that evangelist, like that. pastor. Like that. Most of the boys that really mess with are demons. Ooh, Baby demons. You know guys like demons. You know girls like demons. They're like demon time. Hell cat demons. You know coronavirus. No, you know quarantine on radio. they be like, I want to see them demons. <laughs> <laughs> I watched 85 South Show. You ain't never seen um, Tory Lanez. Um. Yeah, that joke is funny. I used to draw to work li- watching his live. I've been trying thing. to figure out how them people be pouring, yeah. they pour almond milk on their booty. In the shop. And we in Corona time. We don't see y'all over here. One girl had a hoop in her butt. Oh, yeah, Johnny Blaze, she won that money. She did. She, she should have gave she, that money to me. She had a hooker, but I don't understand how you're going to burn your butt. Let me tell you something. If I knew how to work, I'd be on that too. Me too. Getting that money. Yeah. How do y'all feel about OnlyFans? What is that? Lord forgive us, because we don't went from the church to shaking booty. OnlyFans is what all, everybody doing at home. It's kind of like you saw yourself. No, it's not. It's not pouring up. I mean, it could be if if that's the route you're trying to take with it. But some people just go on there and just talk like we are. Some they just want to see some people talk, but not like this. They probably don't have a shirt on. They probably be in a bikini or something like that, or they might be doing weird stuff. But people making money off of it. But it's like you can only degrade yourself for money. Money is not everything. Money is not everything. Honestly, it it, it buys you big day cheesesteaks. Great buy you more than that. Yeah, but that's all I want. You know what I want? A sugar daddy. <laughs> I love you, Brandon, but I love a sugar daddy bow. He usually give me what I want, though. Let me tell you something. I just want to know do men still buy flowers? Yep. Do they Never. I only flowers? got flowers one time, and out of four years of dating, one, four, one time, and that was on our anniversary. And no, I, flowers, flowers. I was laying in the bed, and he came. He went. I said, "It's our anniversary. We're laying in the house." He went. He said, "I'll be right back." This nigga went to pick and save, and bought back a bouquet of flowers. No card. That's so. Beautiful. I think I'm just a, a little brat, but at some time, I know how to get the flowers. I don't think I like flowers. I think I like fruit I and stuff like that. Like I rather get like Edible. like something I can eat. Edible arrangement. Yeah, something I can eat with some with some chocolate on it. But I can't do that uh, flower stuff. I like flowers. I like you pick beautiful flowers. By the way. A man ain't never bought me no flowers. The only person that bought me he bought me a rose. And um, you and he was in a relationship at the time. He wasn't even I we wasn't even together. Friend, he was good. Don't talk about my friend Aaron. Aaron, cool. I like that people. What the heck? That was me. Why did you do that? I didn't. My phone did by accident. Uh, my phone pressed whatever. Oh, we still recording? Are we on the air? Yeah, oh, what's up? Stop. Yeah. She got my nose. 35 minutes. <laughs> you got both of your nose pierced? Oh, yes. Duh. She bought me a rose, and that was so sweet. Like, I want Amanda. I shouldn't have to tell you to buy me some flowers. I want you to do it, you know, just because. But I learned about that me. most men do not know what to do. Sometimes you gotta tell them what you want because they don't be thinking about it. It must be like the new like style of glasses. Oh, I don't know. We didn't plan this. Mm-mm. But my mama get flowers all the time. 
She do. Yes. And I always post them on Instagram acting like they mine. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, I'm they were yours. They know, my mom always get two loops, girl, and they be so um, beautiful. That's what I'm gonna start saying. Yeah, I'm but I'm gonna be mom. like, that's not what I want. I want some food. Girl, Just I want bring food. me some food every day. I, I want food. I want money. I want my feet rubbed. I want my scalp massage. Yeah. I just want to be loved. You feel what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I want kisses on my forehead. While I'm asleep. Where you at, boo? Come get me. Where you at? Please. I think we're kind of zipsy now. Okay, if y'all want to follow me, follow me on Instagram. Underscore love forever. Oh, yeah, I'm going to put it in the bio. I'm going to put it in the description. Mine's is um, two underscores. B-A-U dot R-E-E. J-O-H-N-T-A. B-A-U dot R-E-E. She all in our video. B-A-U dot R-E-E. Follow me, kiddos. Yeah, I think we're feeling good. And we didn't eight. You know. I ain't even going to lie to y'all. I'm ready for 2021. <laughs> Yeah, me too. I'm not. I'm trying to turn 25. Being 2020 had to go. Ooh, that's that's halfway 30. I'm First sorry. First of all, I'm 25. Next year I'll be 26, and I pray Ooh, that wee. next year is my is my year to have a house. Good really? look. Okay. How old are you, Ree? I'm, I just turned 23. You really really good. Good. I'm up there. You Aries? I am. I hate them. Big game. Big big game. You see how we is? We got the whole. We got the whole season. We two here. Capricorn. You ain't got no more cookies? Yeah. We can eat dessert. McBay. Hold on. Can you warm it up? Okay. Get mine's car. Is it hard? I'm gonna get mine's car. Not really. It's just like. You're talking about not really. Yeah, it's not really. Is this something there for me too? The way you just put it on that thing, it felt hard. It wasn't hard. It just was. the top part. Because it's. it's like, that's not really made for brownie. You know, brownie's not really supposed to be in a bowl. Yeah. Oh, you put so it in the bowl hot, like that? Yeah, it'd be so thick. That it thick takes like a while me. to cook in the center. It'd be thick but like that. But on the me. sides, it'd be, that'd be good. Yeah, people be telling me I need to live life. You see what I mean? You really do. You need to stop being scared because that scared shit ain't going to get you nowhere. <laughs> Did you take it? I'm not mad. Bro, we both doing too much because she on FaceTime. I'm on Instagram. Like, I think the look is us. No, we got you. Did you know what's how a day cheesecake clothes? It's probably eight. Eight? What's Because it's eight ten, but I don't know if they change eight hours because Corona. I don't think they're gonna be open at ten. Because that's what I say the website, but they don't say that it's like done. Not done, but they don't say it's like um. We have forty minutes. All right, y'all. We about to uh, stop this video. Hold on, we're about to bring us some brownies, so we got to show y'all. y'all. Show us. We got to show y'all the brownies. Mm. First of all, they might be hard because she over there eating. But really not. <laughs> That's yours. Let me see yours. I got the small one. No, uh-huh. that's about the same. I should have came over here when it was um <clears throat> some. <laughs> <laughs> they good though. So what please. are they? Cookie brownies. Good as me. That's some hot stuff. No. Yeah. They um they come in a box. Yeah? Mm-hmm. You gotta make the cookies, you gotta make the brownies. You put the brownies mm-hmm. in there and then you put the cookies. It's good, y'all. Mm-hmm. That's a good way to end. We made these. Good food. Yesterday. Um, <laughs> y'all made them last night, yesterday. I was at work. And they know. Dang, girl. This is good. This actually is a good topper. <laughs> You like sweets? Yes. I love them. Really, are really tall. Every night. day. I'm a master. Every night. You can run. You gonna put some off? <laughs> I gotta go get some, but I will. You take two seconds. <laughs> you can run. What you got your plate out for? I'm about to make some pizza rolls. Oh, you want some? Oh, you like them? You don't like pizza rolls. If y'all, if you make brownies, I'll stay over. <laughs> <laughs> I've been, that. you know what? Me and, me and Precious say that, you know, they always have them at Food Depot. They don't be having the, they don't be having the turtle brownies at 
uh, Family Dollar. That's Curly Brownies. Ooh, the best one. Is that I, the one? I, I, we don't need to eat these. We is eat that the, the one with the pecans in it? Yes. Yeah, I, like, I like these, though. Pecans or walnuts. Mm. Caramel. Yes. Yeah, but them, they are good. Girl, I like the edges, girl. Oh, well, yeah. I like I'm, I'm an edge type. I'm a middle. I'm a middle, too, sometimes. But... You a middle chick? <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what that means. Me neither. Okay, y'all. We about to go. Out, we'll be back with another video when we find another place to eat at. I hope you enjoy our long video. Yeah, Nobody ain't gonna watch it for 20 minutes. No, but if you don't, it's your loss of the funnies because you missed out. You missed the best part, the brownie. <laughs> Ryan, y'all need to say on the other description, watch to the end. Watch <laughs> to the end because you're gonna miss the best part. It's the end. You're don't saying. fast forward it either. Bye. Go to church. I don't even go to church. Right.